I can't aim! Okay, I almost died. That would have been bad. Oh, Jacob's alive. Quick save. I don't think it's gonna let you do that. I quick saved. Oh, okay. That's good. When it, they only come... They only, uh... Unless you actually heal them, they only come back when you, um... When there's no enemies nearby. Nice. So... The conditions for them waking back up and you uh, quick saving on the same. God, you don't have to shoot your way back out. Yeah. And thank you for me as well. Sure would have feel like that. It seemed like that. I thought about it. tempted for a minute, but in the end, I figured they didn't deserve to die. Merciful of you, risky would have killed them. See, he would have done the same thing. Professor, how can you say that? You're a doctor. You believe in helping people. Lots of ways to help people. Sometimes heal people. Oh, so he Sometimes is gonna whine about that. Either way helps. <laughs> Go check on the page. Yeah, I was I was hoping that Daniel might not whine about getting saved now that you didn't shoot the Batarians, but nope. He's still really, really irritated. Letting him take over the clinic should be able to handle it now that Borja are gone. I honored my part of the bargain, Professor. Of course, mind you, if he was that touchy, he probably would have left when Morton shot up those. Many surprises, but yeah. Need to finish up here at the clinic. Won't take long. Meet you at your ship. Looking forward to it. Okay, leave. We're heading now. See you on the Normandy. So now I guess I can go to um go find Archangel. And we've got like at least two or three, ep three episodes, probably three episodes now. Three episodes of shooting Vorcha. Pretty much, yeah. TV. Pretty much. Fripping. I think I actually left. Let me see. I'm gonna end up back on the Normandy. I'm pretty sure. See, I've been playing too much Hitman on that mission mission cutscene thing, where you yeah. get to see uh, the back of the elusive man. I'm okay. just thinking, okay, I could totally sneak up on him and fiberwire him. <laughs> Welcome to the Normandy, Professor. Yep. It's an honor to have you on board. I do like how you have yes, the introduction for all the people when they first come on board. Unexpected. Yeah, the introduction is good. Not so human centric. I must admit, I'm kind of irritated that Morton was trying to guess what you're going to tell him in two seconds, anyways. Yeah. No distress signals are sent out. No signs of attack. There's virtually no evidence. I completely ignored the part about Cerberus because you could say they're still Cerberus or they're doing the good stuff. I'm just like skipping. Airborne virus, no. Slower than gas. Drug water supply, no. Effects not simultaneous. Intriguing, fascinating. It's interesting watching him try and guess things. Resistance, new technology, marvelously advanced. But what? That's why you're here, Professor. We collected samples from one of the colonies. I'd like you to analyze them and figure out how the collectors did this. Yes, of course. Analyze the. So Borden's main job is to stay on the ship and do stuff. On the lab. Well, Morton's main job is to uh, stand in a lab and deliver snarky quips whenever approached. Yes, exactly. Theoretically, he is doing techno babble to the MacGuffin. Yeah, but well, there isn't really a MacGuffin, but he, he's making the MacGuffin. Well, one of the MacGuffins. The MacGuffin. Yeah, a different MacGuffin. It's complicated. Which will be neutralized by the MacGuffin which he is making. Yeah. Plus two renegade assault rifle damage, yay! So you could talk to Edie about all the rooms in the ship, kind of tutorial esque. Let's see, uh, tech lab, yep. And oops, here's uh, one of the big differences from Mass Effect One and Mass Effect Two. There's an upgrade system now. That's very different, and I have no upgrades I can actually buy. Okay, here we go. Mm. I so think the upgrade system is mostly just buy off the ending. Yeah, there's that too. Ship I'm enhancements. Not sure that it Actually, never mind. Does it let you upgrade your equipment as well? Yeah, you can upgrade like uh, you get damage and wep damage and ammo upgrades for your weapons and accuracy. That maybe that is pretty useful. Yeah, it's it's nah, it's okay. We'll see. What's really annoying is that you have the four different resources. I don't have any upgrades to buy, but there's four different resources, and you need to make sure you have enough of each one before you can actually buy sure. stuff. How can I help? Which leads to oh. the infamous scanning. Oh. Yeah. Everyone loves probes. Expensive, but possibly valuable. Can show you. So he just uh, he just gave me this upgrade that I can do, and every um, 
every squad member has an upgrade that you can do. So, I'll research that just for guns. Why am I over here now? Why am I over there? I was over here. Hey. So I'm just upgrading everything to see iridium required, current iridium, blah 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 blah. And I can't get the missile launcher because I don't have enough iridium. Oh, while we're on the ship, um, I feel like exercising one of my pet peeves. Try and go into uh, one of the rooms that isn't. Okay. Isn't open yet. Let me see if I can. If I don't think there is one on this level right now. Need to go down to the next level. The crew level. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Thank you. Access to life support is restricted. There you go. Access to life support is restricted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This um, one doesn't have the red door. I, I really hate to harp on it too much, but this just really irritates <laughs> me, you know. The captain wants to go into a room? Nope, can't go there. That's restricted. Yeah. Um, but as soon as a new crew member comes on board, well, ooh. It doesn't even make sense because... Let, let's put them in the room we wouldn't let the captain in five minutes yeah, ago. Yeah, it, does, it doesn't make any sense because um, it wouldn't even be that hard to do. This is interesting, though. Shepherd, the men's restroom is on the port side of the ship. Just a little Easter egg. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's always fun, yes. And it obviously does it the other way around if you're a femship. But, let's see. Private terminal. I will know that that's somewhat nicked from Deus Ex, but... Yeah, a lot of games have done that, probably. But, there's a lot of stuff here. Anderson wants to talk to me. Shock was just talking about my scars. There's Zaid. And all the other DLC stuff. That I'm going to ignore. Now, let's go get Archangel. Which is going to involve more shooting. I warn you. Yep, time to battle through another barrel of mercenaries. Uh, the recruitment missions tend to have a lot of fighting in them. The the loyalty missions are considerably more interesting. Well, still, though, yeah. we are... Let's see... How many episodes is it? Something like five or six? So, Morden and Miranda and or Jacob? still boring. I... Would say Morden and Jacob. Where okay. Ron's lines are a bit more irritating. <laughs> Jacob is just boring, as opposed to irritating. Of course, soon we will get our Archangel, and then the score We're fine. Morden and Archangel until the end of time. Well, definitely, definitely Archangel. I'll see who else. Why would you not want Morden in your squad? Because I don't. Because he's not as good. Um. Is combat wise, he dies really easily. You told me the CD already. We'll see who I end up with. There's lots of interesting people in this game, at least. Yeah. To be fair, we should at least try and give Miranda and Jacob a decent shake. We'll we'll, we'll talk to them on board. We'll do that. Oh man. Well, probably. Like At least to do the loyalty missions, since they'll probably do all of them. Oh, well, the loyalty missions, yeah. I guess that makes sense. Unless you're gonna try for it, only Miranda dies right. That would be... Uh, that would be impressive. And I actually like her role in Mass Effect 3, so whatever. Okay, yeah, I still haven't uh, played that. She doesn't have a big role at all. She's not a squad member or anything, but it's not bad. Yeah, I, I heard the squad is somewhat smaller. In it is much smaller. You can't get more than six or seven at a time. And you can have three or four for most of the game. Huh. It's kind of a shame. It's kind of weird, too, because in Mass Effect 2, it seemed like the whole point was getting this giant squad together to do awesome stuff, and then they don't do anything. Is this where I sign up? I mean, it, it makes some sense insofar as, you know, well, they're kind of busy doing stuff. Well, I mean, also, Bioware, well, never mind. So you can, like, save this guy, tell him not to do it because he's dumb, 
Perfect. And if not, we'll see what happens to him later. Now I have to randomly we go somewhere see, else. But we will not be surprised. Yeah, it's kind of obvious. Uh. Yeah, my only question is, does he manage to get killed before or after he gets to the fight? We'll see. My money's on before. Come on, let me in. Well, it's not exactly that far. The transport hub's just here. So he should you... still be able to get himself killed in that time. You know? It's possible. It's very possible. He's a red shirt if ever I saw one. <laughs> I'm on the mission. Not quite as bad as Jenkins. Archangel's been annihilating you freelancers. Ready when you are. I want to know why Archangel yeah, doesn't run out of ammo. Yeah. I want to know why Archangel doesn't run out of ammo. Um, probably because he's an AI. Yeah. And there's a ton of ammo up in that building, as we will see. Of course, that's because there's a lot of fighting up in that building. Yup. <sighs> Morning. Jacob. Let's yeah, see. I do love having to select squad five minutes after I selected squad. Yeah. I, I, like, you select one squad for the story part of the mission, in case they want to make any comments or anything, and then you select one squad for the combat part of the mission. It's about time they send me blah, 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 blah. Yeah, but still, they could, they could solve that just by having an optional, you, bet. you know, do you want to change your squad? Yes, no. Yeah. Instead of making me go through the... But then, they'd, then they'd have to make a whole right. new thing, but that still wouldn't be that hard. And maybe you do want different people. Well, that would fix that. Okay, here's the guy again. And he's just called Guy. Oh, guy. that's bad. That's bad. They tell you what we're up against. Just tell us where to go. Archangels hold up in a building at the end of the boulevard over there. Fancy word. Position, and the only way in is over a very exposed bridge. It's a killing ground. But he's getting tired, making mistakes. It never says what kind of mistakes he makes, actually. I'll get to him. Just point me at that bridge. I, like your I assume he's just, you know, You'll be on a distraction slaughtering mooks slightly more slowly. I don't know. <laughs> so the infiltration team can sneak in behind him. Sounds like a he stopped to take a drink of cola. I think pretty we've much. got him. But you look like yep, you can pretty much. Head up to the boulevard and get to the third barricade. Talk to Sergeant Kathka. He'll tell you when to go in. I better go find Sergeant Kathka. Of course, the fact that I'm just ignoring these people because they don't seem very interesting and not picking the side options might be part of the reason we're doing so much fighting compared to talking. That might be my fault. But I'm just not that interested. Let's worry about finding him first. Uh, boring fighting, boring story, I don't see much difference. Yeah. Let's, let's get to the interesting story. Guess we're going with the Mercs. Isn't that obvious? I can't get over there. Okay, cool. Very boring looking. They have this giant space station. Like, um, this place is kind of like Narshada from Coder, but Narshada looked way cooler. Message to Tarek that I don't care about. I assume they hadn't yet inve invented a copy paste. <laughs> Light mechs go in first. Do you need something? There is certainly a lot of that going on here. So they have There's leaders the of the different um, Jared, mercenary Eclipse. packs, mercenary groups here. So here's Eclipse. Why I'm just asking about them a little bit. Place. I'm pretty sure he's just a planetary so leader. Much. Or Eclipse base leader. Of Omega. <laughs> Our well, I should hope he's not the big leader. Yeah. Eclipse runs like a oil machine. Ah, Omega you've got some blowback or whatever you want to call it. It's a constant battle for control. Then With the mic. Comes along and complicates things. So the Eclipse are the tech users. They have mechs and things like that. Ask really him. annoying engineers. Just here to make as much money as I can. The Blood Pack have regenerating health and big giant guns. And the Blue Suns are just kind of meh. The Blue Suns just going. kind of Good spam idea. dudes. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yay. Oh, hacking. Joy. Well, you it's don't not even hard. Everything, strictly speaking. But I need credits. And it's like in my DNA somewhere. I have to hack, have to get everything. 
Uh, which leads to boring stuff occasionally, but oh well. Uh, there we go. I like how you can actually see the routes on that mini game sometimes. That should slow huh? down. Um, on that mini game that I was just doing, you can actually see the routes on the board of what you're doing. Like they all, like the um, ones that you pick, always follow that route. Well, yeah, it's a fake circuit board. Of course, you can see the traces. Yeah, but at least it's following it, so that's nice. You the blood pack leader? Name's Garm. That's all you. Vortra are annoying. Vortra and Kroger make an interesting combination. They're both kind of aggressive and stuff. It's a shame you can't shoot these dances before you leave. Well, that would be suicide, even for Shepard, possibly. There are mercs everywhere. But... Well, Shepard is gonna go through all these mercs anyways. Yeah, but then he's gonna be in a very defensive position, and he's gonna have help. And a ton of ammo. He could also do what I'm getting increasingly used to, and just poison the drinks or something. <laughs> Having fun with it, man? But he's yes, man. yes I am. <laughs> work for my money. You're making me considering getting it. But I've Watch spent a lot of money already. Yeah, you missed the hitman sale. Maybe it's best to wait till next time. What do you know yeah. about Archangel? He's a pain in the ass. But I, I've, he's a I beat three games in the last three days. Including two Batman, Batman games. So, I was on a roll. But I'm gonna break it today because I'm playing Deus Ex. And that's gonna take longer. Like you've yeah, I've gotten spirit. through two. I've gotten through Limbo and uh, Hitman 2. Limbo is like two hours, if that. It's short. It's short, but it's still pretty awesome. Yeah, I watched I watched someone play it. So. Hitman 2, on the other hand, is not short. <laughs> yeah. So he's talking about... Uh, I keep almost calling him by his name. He keeps calling... He, he's talking about Archangel and how he's getting away and stuff. And I just like listening to Krogan for some reason. Now I haven't seen the blue sun leader. He should be around here leader somewhere. No, I c couldn't but possibly. The blue sun yeah, I one? different one. I couldn't possibly I couldn't possibly get lost here. There's three doors right next to each other. What the heck was that? Oh, he got shot. He can shoot that far out and there that doesn't make sense. Like all the Wait, way to their they base. Shooting each other for fun. I'm pretty sure that was supposed to be a shot from Archangel. Oh, okay. More money. Let's see here. Medical station. Oh. What? I can see it through the door. I can get it through the door. Through the wall. That makes perfect sense. Shepard is just that good at looting. Yep. He has super looting powers. Shoot. I'm getting tired of this minigame already. What, only just now? Well, it's only like the fifth time I've done it. We can use this. I loot! Loot! First time, to be honest. <laughs> and not that interesting. It, it doesn't get any... I'm looking for Sergeant Kathka. You and me both, pal. He's over there working on the gunship. That doesn't make sense. He gives the word. It's like so I'm looking for him too. He's right there. I'll be right I'm back. looking for this guy who I know is right there. Yeah, th th Tell I don't usually talk him. to him. What's Tell over me here? Find he's the guy who is right over there. Yep. That's pretty much. Here he is. What's your problem? You. He is not happy. I guess I can't actually talk to him. Oh, I can talk to her though. The next wave's going soon. Shouldn't you be outside getting ready? Why is he so pissed off? He's not a big fan of you freelancers. Though he definitely doesn't know, he hates having to bring in outsiders. What do you want to know? Well, he might have good reason to what trust, trust you, actually. Yeah. Maybe, maybe the giant N7 on my armor that I just thought about? Weapons, they should know what that means. Also broker deals between I mean, at least marginally. That that just says, I, I'm Alliance. I, I'm, you, I'm not, not a merc. Hey, guys. And then everyone, someone should know who Shepard is. 
Tarek's had enough. I don't blame him. What do you know All of them, that? actually. He's good a thinking. trillion vigilante. Yeah. yeah. Killing Mercs is a fun way to pass the time. Other than that, he's a mystery. He shows up, usually at the worst possible time. Oh, you're he's joking. Our work. <sighs> soon enough, if you ask me. Killing mercenaries is boring as heck. What do you need? Nope. Never mind. Maybe we'll just get going. Good idea. Okay, now I need to go find that. I don't know if he's gonna be a good fit. Yeah. Now, okay, here we go. Casket. Is that all that dialogue was? Do I just go straight to casket? I do. Okay. So this is kind of fun. There's a fairly fun renegade option here. Yeah, I, I I know it. Yep. This is one of very few renegade options that I am going to outright tell you to do. Okay. It's, it's funny. Just, 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 I don't like doing it sometimes because I actually like Casco, oh. but. You met him when you were dropped Wait, when off. do you see him again? Casco? You, you don't. You three kind of stand out. Okay then. This <laughs> uselessness is at an end. The infiltration yep. team is about to give us a signal. Okay, so the most anyone has noticed about me is I kind of stand out. <laughs> yeah. And that's just from the other freelancers. I don't care. Yeah, I, I should hope I stand out from that dolt who spent 50 bucks on a pistol. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't come, who, who we haven't seen for a while now. But that's just because we've been wandering around. I don't care. He might already be dead. We do see him again. Do we see his corpse, or is he actually still alive? You'll see. It won't take long. Oh, I think I actually skipped something. Cask is not the one. Uh, there's a mechanic with the gunship, and I think I missed him. Wait, no, this is him. Okay. Wait a second. Should be coming up soon. I'm getting myself confused. Here we go. You're working too hard. <laughs> Don't tase me, bro. <laughs> he just walks off. Here he is. Doesn't look like Archangel's got much time. We <laughs> Doesn't look like Archangel's got much time. Pistol guy is on the case. Yeah. Oh, he got shot. Come on. You we'll don't say. Of our own. Trouble coming. I could just start shooting these guys. That's funny. But they won't shoot me until I start shooting them. Yeah. Wait till you get into the building. Yep. Really? Yep. <laughs> I just finished killing your buddy. And oh, I died. Figure that out. Wow, I died because I missed. That's funny. I died to these like completely Stay useless the chest high wall. Yeah, apparently. I'm on hardcore. And it punishes me if I do, if I get stupid. And recording. There we go. Let's try this again. After crashing and dying. Okay. But yeah. Mirror's Edge. That was fun. Um, the concept is very different from most games. So that was fun. I got that on the Steam sale. That was actually... I got it for a full $10. Which is actually more than Arkham Asylum. Blah 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 blah. Oh look, more freelancers. Do I just shoot these guys? Yep, I think yes. so. Yes. Surprise! Can I actually get in here? Will there be cake? Nope, I can't get in. I think I just have to kill everyone first. Next! That was fun. That was a really long scream. 
I can randomly open the safe in the middle of the fight. That's fun. I'm bored, I'm bored, what's going on? Are you really gonna loot things now? <laughs> exactly. Shame, Shepherd. And I can go in now. Let's go say hi to Archangel. Let's go steal Archangel's stuff. Hey, he looks familiar. What's up with the blue armor? Archangel. So I wonder if anyone hasn't figured it out, figured out who it is until he actually takes off the helmet. Of course he's a Turian, so may not be able to tell then. They obviously think you should be able to. Well, it's not like there aren't about a million Turians. Yeah. Well, Garrus! Strictly speaking, there should be several billion Turians. What are you doing here? If well, I'm sure there are. Good to see you too. I'm no particular reason to, to think it's that particular. Still, it's good to see a friendly face. Killing mugs is hard work, especially on my own. It's not that hard. You nail be good a couple of times, by the way. Because of rounds only, no harm done. Didn't want the mercs getting suspicious. I don't remember getting uh, shot. I've been shot before, but I don't remember getting shot this time death. by him. It. Yeah, it's Besides, pretty fun. The shepherd will complain regardless. Yeah. Well, that's because he's supposed to. Since when did you start calling yourself Archangel? It's just a name the locals gave me for. All yeah, my you know, you'd think that they might have actually foreseen this outcome. I don't mind it. When they yeah. started inviting random freelancers in. Just but hey, someone actually knows who he is. That's strange. I don't care. Okay. Well, who did? But I don't what? Think um. Will be as easy. No, it won't. The uh, leader should have guessed life, something. All those someone randomly knows him. Works both ways. They'll slaughter us if we try to get out that way. Can't just sit here and wait for them to come to us. It's not all that Morden's not saying much because it's very possible that you haven't gotten Morden by this point. I guess. Jacob's saying a lot more. We hold this location. Wait for yeah, well, I mean, we did just get Morden last fast. Yeah. Our chances. It's not a perfect plan, but it's a plan. I didn't like sneaking anyway. Time to spill a little murk blood. Glad to see you haven't changed. So I get, I just get to shoot stuff for a while. Yep, time to spill a little Looks murk like blood for a change of pace. Yeah, exactly. Scouts, Eclipse, I think. So this option, let's see here. Never made much sense. More than scouts, one less now. Indeed. Full. We better get ready. I'll stay up here. I can do a lot of damage from this vantage No, point. duh. You, what have you been doing the whole time? You can do what you do best. Kill Just stuff. Like time, Shepard. Let's give these bastards everything you've got. Yeah, I, I was gonna say dialogue trees, mm. but I guess that works too. Yeah, especially in this one. Excuse me. Oh, that one. Oh, this is so... It's a shame you can't mine the bridge. Oh, I missed. Yeah. Well, I... There's just so many mechs... Oh. How is he? He was really high. No, I would give a lot for some of those hopper mines from Half-Life 2. Just mm. dump a bunch of them on the bridge. Wait. I'm gonna run out of ammo anytime now. Eclipse marks have made it into the base. Yeah, you've got... Three! Ooh, Vindicator. Ah, oh, dang it. I don't use assault rifles, and now I'm sad. The Vindicator is uh, my favorite assault rifle in the game. Eclipse marks. They're deploying Re snipers. Garrus, you should be able to deal with that. Yeah, he should. Um, I thought you said. Okay, there is more than one. Elbow of death. Alright. Rocket of death. Okay. Elmo of death. Yes. You've said that before. Let's see here. Ah, yes, rocket. Well, it's still kind of ridiculous, no matter how many times you see it. Uh, rockets ever. Get down, get down. Oh, that's nice of you, Mr. Or Miss Eclipse Heavy. Goodbye. 
You mean Most moron. of the times you see that kind of effect, it's, you know, actually looks like blood or blood vessels or something like that. And here it just looks like Elmo hair. Yeah, it doesn't look right. <laughs> 